least most of that rain obviously has stopped. Yeah, uh, it's improved immensely yeah. uh, after last night and the temperatures have come up as well. Uh, look at some of these numbers out there. We've got 90 degrees right now in Taylor. A lot of us are in the mid 80s, but there are definitely some higher temperatures. Metro's now at 87. West Bloomfield checking in at 88. This is obviously above average for this time of year. The good news is the humidity is continuing to go down, so it's not nearly as uh, muggy as what we have seen in the last 24 hours plus. Temperatures are still cooler down here in the south zone where the clouds linger uh, a little bit longer. Some of those showers have been holding on at least through about the noon hour in the south zone. Now we're all clear and looking forward to a dry night. West zone, you're at 88. Linden Howell at 83 right now. Ipsy pushing 90 degrees and some cooler numbers a little bit further to the north. Remember the winds are out of the north right now and even though the speeds at least across the land are not that great out over the open waters of Lake Huron could be seeing 15, 20, 25 mile an hour winds and that's why a Lakeshore flood advisory in effect for Sandalac and St. Clair County. Wave heights here could be three to six feet and that uh, could cause some flooding issues right along the lakeshore. That advisory in effect until 8 a.m. tomorrow morning. So things have cleared out nicely. We're under dry conditions right now and most of us should stay that way until Thursday. The front that eventually what did focus those showers last night and those heavy intense rain uh, rain producers that were right there in Oakland and Macomb County that is now sunk to the south.